People living in poverty have the least access to power to change the structure of policies of poverty and are often denied effective solutions to combat the violations to their human rights. People with mental disabilities or with special needs experience high levels of rights violations, stigma, and discrimination. And I care about this issue because my brother is an innocent man with special needs who has been held in what I call modern day slavery for two years now for a crime that he did not commit. And I come to you because the so-called justice system is not designed to benefit my community. And I can hear the voice of the oppressor echoing, no, you don't deserve to have rights, just us. You are not considered human, just us. You can't afford a good lawyer, just us. You don't have the strength to control your mind, just us. You don't have a history, just us. You don't remember what your fight is about, just us. And my reply to the oppressor is among all the negative stereotypes you digest. My revolutionary spirit rises, rises, and rises, offering an uncontrollable vibration in response to the heart of freedom, unity, and power and equality for all. And to my brother, you and I are together against this wicked system of oppression and white supremacy. And it's bad enough that black men are over flooding these prison plantations. And even worse, when an innocent man is forced to be waiting, waiting, and waiting for the answer to the question, when will it end? And I quote, no one shall be held in slavery or servitude. Slavery and the slave trade shall be prohibited in all of their forms. The Universal Declaration of Human Rights.